to I. Yes, 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 you're live here on Bleaker Radio. Bleaker Radio, we're accepting phone calls all day today. Call in or send us a Facebook message. We're going to go to our first caller of the year. And, uh, hello? Yo, yo, what's up? Bleaker you li- Radio, I'm on. Hello. Yes, yes, you're live on Bleaker Radio. What's going on? Oh, uh, you know, just chilling, chilling. I- is this incognito? Yes, sir. Oh, shit. What a surprise. For you guys who don't know who incognito is, he is one of the original dudes who got down with those 2012. He's in the Marlboro and Sticky Drill video. I, I can't even I can't even express. It's great to have you on. How are you doing? I'm doing very well today. How are you doing, sir? Oh, I'm doing great. I'm doing great. I have a lot of questions to ask you, Incognito. I haven't heard from you in a while. I, I hear you're in Oklahoma now. Yes, sir. Okay, see. Let me, uh... Big. Let's go to a commercial break, and then we'll come right back. Radio, live. Yeah, 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 yeah. We're back on Bleaker Radio, December 21st, 2011. We got a special guest in the studio, Incognito. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Incognito, what, what, what's the state that hip hop's in right now? The state that hip hop's in? Oh, it's coming back. Uh, Nas. You know, he was saying that hip hop is dead, but I don't believe that. Uh, if you believe that hip hop is dead, then it's dead in your realm. You know, of what you perceive as reality. But you know, that you still got the underground rappers and all the underground musical artists. Depends on who you listen to and what style or genre of music you listen to. But I believe hip hop is still alive and well. Oh well, thank God, thank God that you got hope because, oh man, yeah. Uh, I, I like your hope. It, it gives me hope. You, you know what I mean? We're going to a break. We'll be right back. Bleak a bleak a bitch. We're back with in- We're back with Incognito. What are some musical influences influences that inspired Incognito? Oh, uh, well, I would say uh, my first off is uh, Notorious B.I.G., but then I, you know, I moved into the underground hip hop scene. Then I started listening to Big L, Big L, rest in peace. And then uh, I'd say Mac Dre. And then uh, I'm gonna have to say Wiz Khalifa on this one. I love Wiz Khalifa. He's so talented, and uh, I just like the swag and the style he has, and he's rocking with. So I'm gonna have to go with Wiz Khalifa on that one. Yes, yes. He's a new artist, but. You know, he still keeps it real. Keeps in tune with the old school. Oh man, Big L is is awesome. And uh, now you live you lived in AZ for a while. Got real hyphy with Jiggy Fat and Kino Flow. How's the hyphy okay. How's the hyphy scene in Oklahoma? Uh, there's not a hyphy scene out here. That'd be uh, AZ and Cali. Mostly northern Cali and Phoenix goes hard. Riding in my That's shed, right. me some beating something heavy. Spraking on my leg. Yes, yes, I have yes. No we're gonna, we're gonna go to another and break and we'll Lazy be right trees back. Lazy trees is hate. See, the camper out here to high. He be like the street. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You're live December 21st, 2011. Independent Radio. We're, we're gonna talk about... We're gonna talk about some movies. We're gonna get back into filmmaking. We did a lot of uh, hip hop this uh, today. We had Chizzy Sean Mac in the studio. We're gonna we're gonna go into some movies because I, I'm just sick of movies and I'm sick of all the movies and I I need to know if there's any good movies out that I gotta see. Sounds good. What what are some movies I should go see? Uh, I suggest you go see the new Sherlock Holmes. Uh, Game of Shadows, badass, great movie, put together very well by Ra, uh, Downey, Robert Downey Jr., mm-hmm. great, he's always great, and uh, I haven't really been seeing too much movies, I just like watching old school movies, I like watching, uh, you know, the classics, and just movies that most people wouldn't hear about or see in their daily trip to Blockbuster, you know what I mean? 
Yes, yes, I know what you mean. I'm all into those kind of movies, and if you're into those kind of movies, go to my website, www.bleeka.com. Yes. Yes. Yes, we're back. Now, I recall we recorded a few tracks together. Yeah. And and we're also in uh, some music videos together. Explain your experience. Oh, it was great. You know, we were just uh, we were just doing it, doing how we felt like doing it, and we were just doing it big with the HD. Shout out to Kia Flow. Shout out to you know the one and only Jiggy Fat, Bleeka Bleeka. Yes, yes, yes. And- Speaker? Yeah, Bleaky coming out the speaker. And uh, yeah. w- when we get back from the next break, I want to talk a little bit about how f- about film school and how film school fucks artists in the ass. <laughs> you know it. First of all, don't make me burst and brawl. Images nothing, you front and see the thirsty y'all. Okay, we are back live on the air with Incognito. Yeah. Incognito is, is a talented, talented rap star, filmmaker, all the above. He's he's done it all, and and he went to a film school, and I think he had one of the same experiences I did. Just his dream crushed. <laughs> yeah, they pretty much you know they want you to make a film you know what they like, and that's not necessarily what you like and what you feel like doing, you know. So. When you're in that school, which uh, Zachy Gordon Institute, you know, it was a good idea. His son had a good idea. Rest in peace to Dan Gordon's son. But, uh, you know, you know, everything is twisted. Everything is put into a different specter of what they feel like doing. So someone takes it and misuses what the original idea was. And so they hired a bunch of deadbeats who thought they were great filmmakers. But what are they doing? What did they do? They were just teaching and they weren't making anything. They were just, you know, sitting in their house all day critiquing movies they, of success. They were making their own damn movie. They weren't even teaching. They were making their own film. We're going to go on a break and come right back. Yes, yes, yes. We're live in the studio December 21st, 2011. The second night of Hanukkah. Check out the Jewish nudist foodist for your Hanukkah. Hello? Oh yeah, sorry, I just got cut off. Oh, we, it's all it's all good. We're back live on the air. You're on the air. Sounds good. All right, Incognito. How can people get a hold of you? Yeah, you're building a solid foundation. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, it's great having you on the air. I'm gonna, I'm gonna stay on the, stay on the line. Uh, I'm gonna talk to you when we go on the break. Sounds good to me. 